Good evening, everyone. I am PJ. Welcome to Grace Hollow Rabbit. Um, something I haven't done in quite a while was update on the brood stock, and so I thought I would go through and just give you a quick update um, on the New Zealand blues where I'm at with those. All blues. right, first doe. Uh, here we have. Um, you know, I keep calling her Blue Sky. Uh, actually, I think her her name is uh, actually Sky Blue, uh, but uh, anyway, this young lady came to me uh, from Oklahoma. Yes, yeah, she was a gift All to right. me. All right, and then here we have Dave, and Dave obviously is um, a black buck, and you've seen him before. Um, he's been here for a while. He he he's just a real good producer, and just recently. I have discovered and then confirmed that he is a blue carrier and so now I use him uh, in my blue program and uh, I'm hoping uh, for some great babies out of this guy uh, great blue babies <laughs> Dave is uh, actually Dave came from the same breeder as um, a blue sky over here uh, Dave has had quite uh, quite the life. Uh, he was purchased initially from a different rabbitry over in Oklahoma, and then uh, that fella got out of New Zealand, and so uh, he was purchased by a young lady uh, here in o uh, Arkansas, and she got out of rabbits, <laughs> and so I, I got Dave. From her, uh, so he, you know, I'm her, Dave's fourth owner, and uh, he's, you know, he he's just been a real good. All right, and then here is Nellie, and Nellie uh, currently has a two-week-old litter, uh, a whole bunch of blues in there, uh, out of Dave, and Nellie ha is my only broken blue doe. Uh, she came to me from Northern Illinois. Uh, I've had her uh, a little over a year now, and she has raised, I believe she has raised, this is her third litter. Uh, it might be the fourth, but I think it's her third. So, uh, you know, she's been a pretty All good right. mom. And here is my, um, currently, my only blue buck. Uh, this is Kirby, and he's been a pretty good uh, sire for me. He's He's worked really hard, and he's been very productive. Uh, I've changed his breeding program up a little bit. Uh, I have uh, two broken black does that are rather large, uh, who are grand champions. And so I'm going to start breeding him to those two girls uh, and try to get some blue carriers uh, out of this guy that's a little bigger than him. Uh, Kirby, <laughs> I've mentioned before, runs on the small side. In his prime, he's only about 9 to 9 4, uh, but he has a difficult time holding that. He's usually between uh, 8 and a half and about 8 12. Uh, so, anyway, I'm hoping to get some bigger kits out of him and then he'll be ready to go and help someone else. Uh, Kirby came to me from Illinois uh, with uh, Nellie. So he's been here a little over a year now All as well. All right then, uh, and then here we have Daisy, and Daisy is out of Hero and Dave, and uh, she's a broken black, but she carries the blue gene, and so I have her uh, in my blue program. So uh, she's doing well, and she's producing some blues. And we've recently found out uh, Daisy's also a very good foster mom. Uh, she's a cranky mom, and so I was hesitant to give her uh, any kits, uh, but I, I need, they needed to go somewhere. We had eight youngsters orphaned uh, when Madison passed away, and so uh, the last two uh, I put here were Daisy, and uh, she surprised me. Uh, even though she's a picky mom, a fussy mom, uh, she's she took right to these two reds, and she's been raising them quite.
quite well, so good job, Daisy. She's a beautiful doe, is she not? <laughs> All right, here is a broken black buck. Uh, he's also a blue carrier. He is uh, out of ink and a b um, alley. Uh, a blue doe I used to have um, named Allie. Um, and he's been a pretty good producer. Moco, uh, however, will be leaving. Uh, he has a new home, so he'll be leaving us here uh, next weekend. Not this weekend, but next weekend. He is going to Oklahoma. Um, oh, to the same breeder that bred Dave. Uh, so uh, he's going uh, back to that breeder in Oklahoma. And we will miss him. Uh, he's um, a senior now. He's a registered. Uh, no, he's registered. He still needs one more leg, and then he'll be a grand champion. Um, I guess that's really all I can say about Moko. <laughs> uh, he is the brother to Possum Grape, who you will see next, and he's also the brother to Cash, who I will show all you right. shortly. And our last uh, doe. This is Possum Grape. Uh, she's also a registered grand champion. And like I said, she's the brother, or she is the sister to Moko uh, and Cash. They are out of ink and a blue doe I once had named Allie. And she's, uh, this is her, oh, this is the first litter she has raised. So she's been very well. Uh, she is a blue carrier, if I didn't mention that. Uh, She's given me, uh, what has she got in there, a broken blue? Uh, I think she has one blue and one broken blue. Uh, so, you know, I'm hoping they turn out with good body types. And then she's got the black and the broken black. And then she's also fostering the two uh, red out of um, Madison. Good job, possum. Another lovely And then goat. here we have, last but not least, is Cash. And he's the brother to Possum Grape and Moko. He is a registered grand champion. And uh, he, out of the two brothers, uh, he's the one I decided to keep. Uh, although Moko is, you know, equally nice. It just, uh, I, I just, I like the pattern on Cash better. And so he's the one. Uh, but Moko has the better nose marking. Moko has a full nose marking to where Cash here uh, only has half. So, <laughs> or at least it's uneven. So uh, Moko has an even nose marking. Uh, but I, I like Cash best, so he's the one okay, I kept. so that's it for the New Zealand Blues. Uh, I'm a little buck heavy. Um, I have... What do I have? One blue doe, one broken blue doe, and then two broken black doughs that carry blue. So I only have four doughs right now. Uh, now I have two blue doughs growing out who's going to be coming up. Uh, so, uh, you know, you've seen those in the grow out updates. Um, I just brought them home from Illinois two weeks ago. So they've got uh, their youngsters. It's still going to be three or four months uh, before they're bred. And then I have, currently, I have four, uh, is it four? Yes. Currently I have four bucks that's used in the uh, blue program. Uh, I had Dave, who's a black buck, who carries blue. And then uh, Moko and Cash, who are both broken black, uh, but they carry blue. Uh, Moko will be leaving us, however. And then we have only the one blue buck, Kirby. Uh, but that's it for the blue program. We've got some growing out, and we've got some in the nest box growing up. Uh, so we have plenty of blues to choose from. Uh, hopefully this fall I will begin to show them. Hopefully we'll have something nice that we can add to our breeding program uh, early spring of next year. Thanks for watching.
And until we speak again, God bless.